So there is this note in Blender called Checker Texture and you can do some pretty cool stuff with it like change the scale and also change the colors but there's nothing more than that and this is the downside yeah it's so limited but in Blender there's a better way to do pixelated textures and it's using the brick texture because here you can set the squash to something like 0.5 and then the frequency to 1 and you get this kind of texture. And then if you change the offset from 0.5 to 0, you basically get the same as the checker texture, but with a little bit more variation. And you can remove this black grid by just setting the mortar size to 0. Okay, and with a color ramp node, you can apply some custom colors. Okay, let's use this for example and it looks like some kind of sand texture. And now I will show you how you can do some pretty cool stuff with it. So first you can change the scale, but you can also add something like a noise texture. But the problem is if you add a noise texture here, this is stylized and stuff, it's cool, but it's not pixelated anymore. And that's why you can grab something like a Voronoi texture and set it from Euclidean to Chebyshev. I hope I pronounced that right. Chebyshev, I don't know. And then let's set the factor to one and you see this looks very cool. You can use this for some kind of sci-fi stuff. So maybe desaturate it, make it a little bit darker. Yeah, and you can change the scale here. You can change the scale here and get some really cool patterns with it. Next thing is Blender has this magic texture. And if you set this to zero, you get this pixelated texture again and you can experiment with that too and let's bring back the color yeah you can get some really cool stuff out of this and another thing is to get the wave texture wave texture not wave length and plug this into the b2 and then just make the scale a bit lower and you get these lines yeah, and these are some pretty cool methods you can use to create pixelated textures in Blender. It's very easy, just experiment a bit. And yeah, that's actually it. I hope you liked this video and I'll see you next time.